things that uh, creep on the earth, such as worms. Um, quite frankly, I never felt attracted to eating worms. Neither felt I did I feel attracted to eating spiders or flies or snakes. Indeed, uh, I guess no one of us, you know, we have a sort of a natural uh, disgust for those uh, kind of animals. We do know that we can eat the rest of the apple. We can eat around the worm, so to speak. <laughs> You can cut it out before eating the apple. It doesn't make the whole, the whole apple unclean. Next. Aye, aye. How to eat the things that creep upon the earth? Okay. Ah, okay. 41 and 42, I think that's what we just read. Very nice. But again, it mentions that uh, this is an abomination. Fun. And rightly so, it also lists uh, snails, and frogs, mice, rats, uh, Lizard. lizards, yes. By the way, in the West, this is the snail is also considered by some as a delicacy. So on fairs, you can find stands where they sell snails, fried snails. Do they do that in the Philippines too? No, 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 never. Some people eat it. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's an abomination. Just as unpolish, this is also an abomination. Needless to say, an abomination is of course sin. We don't do that. Next. Space bar. Yes. Space bar. <laughs> Not to eat any vermin of the earth. Verse uh, 44. Um, we sometimes hear or read about uh, people saying what is the reason that we cannot eat pork and the reason given is because it's unhealthy. Yahweh's stated reason is that we must be kadosh, that we must be holy, as He is holy. Um, I did not read anywhere that uh, Yahweh says that eating those things is unhealthy. I do believe there is reason to believe that it is unhealthy, but the the thing is, Yahweh doesn't say so, so if ever you find a study which says that how uh, beneficial it is to eat, uh, I don't know, shrimp, eh? and then just one thing, or unclean fish, or maybe how healthy it is to eat rats, well, who knows, I have some doubts about it, but anyway, be aware of the fact Yahweh himself does not say that health reasons are the reason for not being allowed to eat these animals. The stated reason is uh, you must be kadosh as I am kadosh. That's the reason. Um, I'm mentioning this because uh, pork at least is a very popular food in the world. I think in the whole world except for Muslims <laughs> and Jews. Um, I would say if it's extremely unhealthy, then in countries uh, where people eat pork uh, very frequently, well, 
they should die at least 10 years earlier than, uh, than the average Muslim. And quite frankly, I don't see that happening. There are quite a few people who reach 100 years old and they have eaten pork all their lives. <laughs> so maybe, maybe, uh, well, maybe there is an indirect health reason. Um, I can't really prove it, but it could be that diseases are easily, tra more easily transmitted uh, if you eat pork or other other unclean animals. So maybe we can understand the word unclean also as sort of contaminated, that you are contaminated and you will are probably going to contaminate others, so you might pass on uh, viruses or bacteria more easily if you eat pork. So that, that, That could be an, um, an indirect health reason that you are actually posing a threat to the health of others.